Hey, welcome back, and if you're new, I'm glad you're here. Today I have an ostrich feather floor lamp that I absolutely love. Very expensive lamp. Normally, it's a Josephine feather lamp floor lamp. It's like $1,545. I created mine for only $53, and I absolutely love it. I also went ahead and illuminated it with some LED lights that I got off of Amazon. I'll put that description bar below. So what you're going to need is a floor lamp. You can get a cheap one for $20 from Walmart or Ikea, glue sticking glue gun, E6000 and you're also going to use these LED lights. These are optional. I just wanted to light mine up and I really like these because there's different colors and it's pretty awesome and it runs by battery. Also you're going to need some floral foam. I got this flat round. It's sort of thick so I can insert the feathers and also a half round and I'm going to show you how we're going to construct that in a moment. The last thing, the piece de resistance, are these big, beautiful, extra large plumes. Now these are ostrich feathers. Just choose whichever color that you want to do yours with. I just happen to choose white. So we're going to get started. You're just going to go ahead and add lots and lots of E6000 in hot glue. Make sure that um, basically you get it all around because you want it to really stick well and have a nice adhesion so when you go ahead and insert your feathers, they're going to stay in place. So that's basically what we're going to be doing right now. And it's that simple. Now we're going to start adding on the big feathers. This is the fun part. Now as you can see, I'm putting a little bit of hot glue on the area that I'm going to be inserting these feathers because I just want them to stay when I put them so they're not going to be moving around. And as you can see, it's really quick and really easy. This was so much fun, you guys. <laughs> Now that I'm done with that row, I'm going to actually go in between each of the feathers that I already put in. So that way you'll have the best full look that you want because you want it to look really full and have like a palm tree look to this actual floor lamp. So as you can see, I'm just going in between the first row of feathers. I'm going up a few inches and then I'm going to put the second row in between the first row. right in between and it goes really fast just a little bit of glue holds it in place now that I'm at the top of it you're going to actually do the same process just go in between each of those rows in between each feathers and that's how you get the fullest look this went really really fast you guys but it turned out so pretty now, I do want to show you what I did with the back. So I started to apply them in the back also, but I went ahead and took them out the back because I want to show you how I'm going to add in the LED lights. Now, this is the LED lights that I ordered. This is optional. It's not something that you have to do. I just wanted different colors and I just wanted lights. I didn't want to use the plug-in because it would probably be a fire hazard but I chose these because they have different colors and I can switch it up and it's very easy because it's battery operated and you can switch it off and on with the controls on it if you want I can put that in the description bar below and also the link for the feathers now what I did is there's some tape a red tape that's a strip so it's easily applied and it's basically adhesive so you just peel that off and apply it and it's that simple but like I said I want to show you in the back where it would go now that it's done I'm all ready to go ahead and get this baby in I had a really tall lamp that was 72 inches and I absolutely love it you don't have to go that tall guys so I had to get on a ladder to put mine up and then what I did was I went ahead and glued it in place with some hot glue and it's perfect and this is what it looks like illuminated. I just chose this color because I love the color pink. But I want to show you guys how pretty it is by cutting the lights down and showing you up under the lamp how gorgeous this is. And it's so full. Absolutely love this. Now this is where I styled it. I'm showing you it in the corner of my living space. It's next to a large mural and some French doors to my back door behind the sectional. <laughs> But I absolutely love the way this, this came out, guys. So I hope you guys like it also. If you do, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Like and subscribe and hit the bell for notifications for more great videos like this. And have a great day.